Today I'm at Leader CNC in Nuneaton. I'm standing in front of here this Kitamura My Center HX250 IG. Now this is a horizontal machining center, uh, but what I want to start with today is talking to you about why you might adopt this type of machine tool solution because it is a little bit different. Uh, now you'll notice that this is actually a horizontal with a 10 station pallet pull on it. Now the difference there basically means that you can load this machine up and it can be equipped and prepared for an overnight run uh, as opposed to just having a horizontal with two pallets. Now you may be thinking to yourself at the moment, well actually um, that's no use to me because my volumes don't uh, require uh, or I don't have the volumes for that. Well actually maybe this isn't about that, maybe this story is a little bit different. I've tried to think differently. The way I'm thinking now is that let's look at your machine shop as having lots of different types of components. Uh, you don't quite know what's coming in from a day-to-day -day basis, but what you do want is to be able to run maybe out of hours to get the most out of your uh, plant. And that's when a 10 APC can come in handy. Now imagine you could set this machine before you go home in the uh, evening, and then you can run it overnight. And when you come in in the morning, 10 pallets worth of components will be machined and finished. And as I said earlier, it doesn't have to be the same component. It can be lots of different components. You can have all the different programs preset, you can have all the tools preset, and you can have the 10 stations uh, equipped and ready to be machined. So that's the solution. What about the machine tool behind it? Well, the Kitamura machines, as, uh, as it says on the side of the machine, have true geometric accuracy. That means there is no, uh, there is no parameters or offsets within the parameters to change uh, axes movement to get more accurate results on machining. In fact, the way the machines are built is they are built uh, without having to use any additional software to maintain positional accuracy. And in fact, these machines will repeat uh, to less than a micron, I'm reliably told. So they're extremely accurate machines. They're also very fast machines. You can actually uh, machine at cutting feed rates of up to 60 meters a minute with, for example, the 15,000 RPM spindle that we have in here. Uh, you can actually have a 30,000 RPM spindle as well. But 60 meters a minute, that's pretty quick. And that's a cutting feed rate. Um, not just milling as well though, this machine you can turn on. That table in there will rotate at 300 RPM. So you can do turning functions as well as milling functions. In the back of the machine is where the tools are mounted. And there is 102 tools in the machine. So that means that if you are loading up, for example, 10 pallets here, you have enough tools in the back of the machine to be able to, uh, to run that unmanned run. And the fact that you've got 110 tools also means you can get the benefit out of the tool management system, sister tooling, because this machine has all that as well. Uh, the tool management system will ensure, the tool management solution will ensure that uh, whether a tool has been used too many times, uh, whether it's, there is significant tool wear and it needs to then use a sister tool within the magazine. All of that is standard here on this solution from Kitamura. This is a 15,000 RPM spindle as standard. It is also a 250 mil pallet machine. Now, I'm again led to believe that this is the only 250 mil horizontal machining center now available in the market. And as the brochure actually states, it's for small precision uh, components at high speeds. That's what you're using this machine to manufacture. And would you believe with all of that, how small the machine actually is even with the uh, 10 or the 10 station pallet pull system and the horizontal machining center together it's it's a very very compact small footprint with this pallet station here as well as i said earlier if you're running through the night once it's finished all 10 pallets the whole machine will just shut down so it's a bt30 machine over 100 tools i think it's 102 tools 15,000 rpm 250 mil uh, pallet system can turn the b-axis up to 300 RPM. The achromatic control here from Kitamura, a very, very powerful control that is very popular amongst users around Europe and around, um, around the world. Repeatability, less than a micron. Tool change time, tool to tool, less than one second. And all of this available here from stock at Leader CNC. I'm encouraging you here to think differently about your machine tool purchase. Have a think about running the machine overnight, running the machine at weekends, going away from the factory at six o'clock in the evening, pressing the button and coming in in the morning 
to a pallet pool full of completed components. Regardless of the, uh, the volumes of, uh, of parts that you're doing, they can be different components. And the beauty of a machine like this with turning and milling function, uh, you can pretty much tackle any type of part as long as it fits within that 250 uh, millimeter envelope. Available here from stock, come and see it in Nuneaton, uh, leadercnc.co.uk.